Welcome to Morning Man with Pastor Steve Myrie. This morning's topic, Open with God. Have mercy upon me, O God, according to thy loving kindness, according unto the multitude of thy tender mercies. Blood out my transgressions against thee, the only have I sinned, done this evil in thy sight, that thou mightest be justified when thou speakest. And be clear when thou judges. Psalm 51, 1 through 4. Saul was anointed by God to be king. He was more moral than David in that he didn't struggle in some of the areas that plagued David. His weakness wasn't outward, it was inward. Saul looked like a king, whereas David looked like an underage juvenile delinquent who should have been home taking care of the flocks. But David, wasn't in the palace. He was out there with the men fighting the giants and bringing it about change. Saul's armor shined in the noonday sun. David had no armor. He fought naked, free from the entanglements of trying to be impressive. He was not ashamed, even when his weapon looked substandard. It was just an old rugged sheep slingshot. Although David's weapon was outwardly substandard, it was nevertheless lethal led to the destruction of the giant. We can never destroy our enemies with superficial armor of a pious king. We don't need the superficial. We need the supernatural. David's naked, transparent demeanor was so translucent that he often seemed extremely vulnerable. He seemed almost naive at times. When he worships, he does it with holy abandonment. When he lost, he does it to obsessive dimensions. You would almost think he was unfit, except that when he repents, there is something so powerful in his prayer that even his most adamant critic must admire his openness with God. Hide thy face from my sins, blot out all my iniquities. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me. Cast me not away from thy presence, and take not thy Holy Spirit from me. Restore unto me the joy of thy salvation, and uphold me with thy free spirit. Then I will teach transgressors thy ways, and sinners shall be converted unto thee. Deliver me from blood guiltiness, O God, the o God of my salvation, and my tongue shall sing aloud of thy loving kindness. Psalm 51, 9 through 4. The quote of the day. We don't need the superficial, we need the supernatural. As you go today, go with the assurance knowing a broken spirit and a contrite heart, God will not despise. God bless you in Jesus' name.